welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. So subscribe, turn on post notifications, subscribe, like, comment, share, and let's get straight into the video. But first, I'm going to tell you what we're actually going to do. So by the title of this video, you guys might already know. I don't know if I've actually done this before. If I have, then it's not a little bit different. Actually, it will be a little bit different because every single time I do something different if I do it the same. So, um... Oh yeah, okay. So, uh, here's what we're doing. Here's a video, I mean, a screenshot of an old video that I did, I think. And if not, then scratch that. But this is what we're doing. Um, I think I already did a video about this, but whatever. Anyways, today we're going to be doing, like, a guinea pig cage tour, tips for guinea pigs, and just a lot of stuff in one. Like, a lot. Lot. Well, let's get started. Well, actually, yeah, this is good. So good. That I have for my guinea pig. Hopefully, you guys like and subscribe. Here we have a lot of stuff, honestly. So we have his little tunnel. Don't mind clothes and stuff. This is inside my closet. Don't mind this. It's not for him. Okay, so I have his little tunnel. It's not really the best size for this cage that he has so yeah but when i let him out to play yeah and sometimes i do put it in his cage okay this is a DIY tunnel that he does not like at all whatsoever so i have his vitamin drops i made the little container myself yeah why containers be like I have a couple of fabric stuff in there but he doesn't really like it. It's not big enough. Apparently, he's too big for everything I make, pretty much. <sighs> okay. And then, here's another thing. This has a lot of fabric in it, too. This was, like, kind of like a fleece first or something. Except it wasn't. Like, it wasn't made for that. It was made for something else. But the thing broke. So, if I do make another one, then I have that still. But, yeah. And then I have water because... I actually do not know, but yeah, I have water. I have this towel so that barely anything gets on the carpet because it takes a while to get stuff like this off. Because then, um, yeah, it's just, yeah. And then I have his adult guinea pig food essentials, Otspo. I have, wait, wait, I don't have the gardens or whatever. I had that once. He didn't really like it, though. Now we have some Timothy hay. We have a lot, and I actually have to fill his container up. But yeah, now let's get into his house. Okay, so we're going to start over here. So he has this little bed that I also DIY'd. And then these two stuffed animals that are not waterproof. It's just they're way too small to be put in my bed. I would lose them right away. So I gave them to Gizmo. Hi, Gizmo. I'm making a video. I'm making a video, Gizmo. Do you like it? Yeah, so that little thing was for the tunnel that I was talking about earlier. It went inside the tunnel, but it wasn't like hot glue to it or whatever. So I took it out. He likes that a lot, and it fits perfectly. And that's his little hidey house. Then it's supposed to be a hay rack, but I don't really use that hay rack. Sometimes I do. As you can see, there's hay right there. But, yeah. Um. So then this is his food bowl. He gets fed. Vitamin C drops because they do not produce their own vitamin. I mean, <laughs> lemon or vitamin C. They do not produce their own vitamin C. Next, we have this kebab. It's really cute. Um, I got it from PetSmart. I got basically all the stuff from PetSmart. Except for the DIY stuff. I guess he really likes that thing that I'm going to show you next. So... Yeah, it's a little kebab. It has stuff. He can eat it. He doesn't really like it, but he does chew it on sometimes, but not all the times. So yeah. So Gizmo's eating hay right now. So. Yeah, so he really likes this hay container. Honestly, he just wants hay. So at this point, it's like, whatever. Here's his water bottle. I got both of these from PetSmart. Um, I also got his food bowl from PetSmart. And I also got that from PetSmart. Yeah. Hi, baby boy. He's not my baby boy. Then this is the DIY hammock. I need to cut it upside down because it has 
lot of poops in it. Okay, so Gizmo's on the way, so I'm just gonna put it on top of him. Won't harm anybody. Okay, so that's his little thing. Hi, Gizmo. Here, I'm gonna take that off so that he'll go on there. Come on, Gizmo. Go, 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 go. 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 Okay. He's right by it. Go. Go in the little hammock. Baby boy. Go into the hammock. Please. Please, 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 please. Good boy. Thank you. Okay, so he really likes it. I know I forced him in there by, like, telling him I didn't actually put him in there, but yeah. Um, but he does like going on there, but as you can see, he got right out for the food. But yeah, so Gizmo. Wanna look at the camera? Go follow Gizmo's Instagram account. Um, his account is Gizmo. I think it's 1222 or something. Yeah, it will be on the screen. Go follow his account. Also, go follow mine. And also, go follow my TikTok accounts. Everything will be right here on the screen. Moment of silence. Now, we're going to do a montage of Gizmo doing whatever. Let's go.